All right. Thanks so much for being here. Um, my name is Carrie. I'm going to just chat with you a little bit about our programs and what we're all about here as the regenerative health community. So our programs are all designed to help your body get into thrive mode, right? That's that's the main focus of everything that we do. And we are regenerative health coaches. I'm a regenerative detox specialist and holistic nutritionist, as well as a traditional naturopath. And I love helping people know that suffering is optional. Um, so this call is really education-based and it's focused on letting you know that there are solutions to degeneration and to disability and to disease. And all of these are caused from one side of chemistry, which is the acid side of chemistry and the depleted side of chemistry. So when we do not have our essential micronutrients, we don't have our essential amino acids and we have our body is filled with pesticides and chemicals and processed foods and all the things that we get exposed to in our environment, our system just starts to go down, right? It becomes sluggish, it becomes toxic. So our programs are really designed to nourish, regenerate, rehydrate, and then remove obstacles like pesticides, parasites, microbes, and bacteria that are harmful. So the way that this is, is um, really understanding a lot about the food system. So our food is deemed uh, only 1% of the United States soil is actually deemed nutrient dense. So that's a big problem. Um, it actually means that what we are eating does not contain the proper nutrition it needs to help repair the human body. So as a human, we need nine essential amino acids from our plants. We can't get them anywhere else. Um, and those amino acids are what help repair and rebuild bone, hair, skin, connective tissue, but also carry out tons of functions inside the human body. So the human body actually makes many of its amino acids, but nine of them we don't. And those combine with the ones that we make to make 26 in a whole, and they perform over 200,000 different operations in the body. So it's really a very important role to have our essential amino acids. And when we don't have our essential amino acids, we start to see things like infertility, chronic disease, um, you know, just the breakdown of the human body, the breakdown of the connective tissue and skin and so on. And so because we can't make these amino acids and they only come from plants, it's important that our plants have them. And what we're learning in soil health and soil research now is that our soil is so depleted that the plants don't contain their essential amino acids. And when they're in non-organic soil, they have almost none. And the reason is, is because uh, glyphosate, which is a neurotoxic chemical that's sprayed in our environment on a regular basis, it's deemed safe and legal by the United States government. Um, and it's banned in over 30 countries worldwide, is a class one carcinogen. And it is um, neurotoxic and it's a it's patented as an oral antibiotic and it's directly linked to many many diseases like non-Hodgkin's lymphoma, Alzheimer's, ADHD, autism, cancers and beyond. So when this became legalized, the reason they deemed it safe and legal was because it actually they they found that it did block something called the shikame pathway um, in plants. But humans don't have that pathway. So they thought, well, we're safe. Humans don't have this pathway. But the shikame pathway in plants is the essential pathway that these plants fold their proteins, their essential amino acids that the humans need to consume in order to repair our bodies. And so when we damage the plant, we damage the human. And that is what has happened in our farming industry. And in addition to that, one spray of glyphosate kills off 50% of the earthworms. And those earthworms are so essential to the soil breakdown, the nutrient breakdown, the micronutrients that are going into the soil and being taken up by the plant. And so what we're seeing is depleted soil, depleted plants, stressed plants, which is really interesting. There's actually a lot of research uh, around microRNA um, and how we actually have stress tails on, on our RNA and on our DNA. We have these little stress tails. And when we eat food that is high stress, it actually shows up as an expression on our cells. Um, so there's a lot of research around that if you follow Dr. Zach Bush and um, it's really fascinating to see how much it can affect our DNA, what we're eating, whether we're choosing really stressed out hormone fed factory farmed meat, or whether we're eating organic, well-grown, nourishing, non-stressed plants, um, creates a huge difference in how, how we operate and how our body receives that nutrition. 
So long story short is our soil is not have doesn't have what it needs. And this is the beginning of the undernourishment piece. In addition to we are in a fast food nation, right? We everything we have is in a box or in a package or at a fast food restaurant and it's not real food. So we've really come to this space of not eating real food. And when we are eating real whole foods, it actually isn't containing the amount of nutrients that we need anymore because of the way that we are fast farming. And so fast farming um, causes a lot of nutrient deficiency because we aren't rotating the crops properly. We aren't letting the soil heal. We aren't, um, they're potentially tilling the ground, which ruins the microbiome of the soil. There's so much that goes into yielding a healthy crop. And this is part of what's called regenerative agriculture. And so regenerative agriculture is a practice that you're gonna see on the rise. There's actually something called Regen Certified coming out now. Um, and that's gonna be the new label to look for outside of organic. It means that your food was grown in regenerative soil and it's gonna have the most yielded nutrients as possible. So with that said, because we have this issue, we needed a solution to this. And in my practice, um, and the, the clinic that I own and operate, I just saw more and more patients with the inability to stick to protocol because they felt depleted. And I was really searching for a solution to this depletion, which is how I found Perium and how I integrated this into my practice and now here sharing it with all of you. So what Perium is and what our protocols are, are regeneratively grown micronutrient rich superfoods, literally a solution to the problem that we have. I didn't think it existed. I searched and searched and searched and couldn't find it. Um, and luckily I was introduced to Perium by somebody I went to school with, with Dr. Robert Morse at the International School of Regenerative Detoxification. So um, I'm more than happy that I found it and it has totally changed my life and my health overall. So Purium has um, essential amino acids. Our program is designed to have all of your essential amino acids. And it's basically the nine that we're missing, the nine essential amino acids you need as a baby and you need eight as adults. It is all made from sprouted non-soy legumes. And these are actually made by an Italian doctor and they're used widely across the UK um, to repair with patients that have pancreatic cancer or um, post-surgery ops so that they don't muscle waste and all those things are used widely in the medical field there. And we're hoping that someday that comes to happen here. Uh, next is our micronutrient shake and it contains 96% of your micronutrient needs in a glass. Um, and it, it, it's a, approximately four to five salads is the approximation about what you get nutrient density from comparison of eating a salad to what's in this shake. And the third part of our program is called Biome Medic, and that is a certified third party tested um, herb that actually removes pesticides, removes glyphosate, that chemical I was talking about. Um, out of the body. And this is really important because glyphosate tears holes in tight junctions. It tears holes in the gut lining, um, kidney spleen, like it, it causes, a, it wreaks havoc on our system and causes endocrine imbalance and hormonal imbalance. And also the, it builds this plaque on the bowel walls. And we have something called microvilli on our bowel walls. So we have microvilli that come out their hair like extensions that actually grab onto nutrition and then eliminate them, or excuse me, deliver them to the cells. Um, and when those hair like projections are, are filled with plaque, obviously they can't work. They can't project out and grab onto the nutrients and deliver to cells. So we're seeing a large nutrient deficiency on many levels. One first coming from the soil and then two coming from because we have this plaque built up and we have poor absorption and we can't utilize the nutrition that's coming in. And so this hits it from both angles. We have the nutrient density food and then we have the solution to remove the pesticides out of the gut and repair the microvilli. The fourth part of our transformation is called apothecary and it's organic tart sour cherry juice. It's cold pressed. One serving is the equivalent of 30 cherries. It's phenomenal. Um, it helps with deep sleep. It helps with melatonin production. It's packed with antioxidants and polyphenols. It helps with tighter, brighter skin and so many things. So um, this is what our program is all about. You do all these things twice a day 
And then in the 10 middle days, you do something called super cleansar. So the super cleansar is um, a parasite and microbial cleanse where you would just get rid of parasites and microbes and all of that jazz and get your body back into balance. So that's what our program's all about. And I'll open up for more questions now. I just wanted to give that explanation for you all. Okay, Julie, do you have a question? <laughs> 